Hey, what's going on, everybody? Blaze for here and tap for you guys another video of Black Clover Mobile. Inside today's video, guys, I'm gonna be showing you guys my best defense team here, pretty much using it on attack. You guys have already freaking seen it, and I gotta say, it gets the job done. We've been doing pretty dang decent with it, and a lot of you guys have needed some defense teams at least recently. So I've decided I'm just gonna go ahead and tell you guys what it is. Now, you guys have definitely seen this before. It's not anything new. This is actually the team that I used, I think, two days ago, in which I've been actually sticking by using it. And it's been really, really nice so far. You got a little bit of the speed here. You got, of course, your defense from Asta. You got a defensive shield from Noel, and then some more damage with Julius. Now, the way that this team is going about here, if you do want to use it, your Noel needs, and I mean needs, to have defense on her so if you do want to of course use this be sure to have moonlight necklace use at least two pieces of defense and you can go by your day but um if those aren't on there you will have a little bit of a or at least a problem trying to use this here because noel can die pretty easily even in the team that i'm currently using with this with the current stuff that she has she can die but it's a little bit harder so of course we're going to be going ahead and using this in pvp as usual and just giving it a shot now, originally, I did try <laughs> to do sneaking solo dolo Asta. Listen, I don't care what nobody says, bro. That junk is difficult as crap if you don't have a team <laughs> or if you're not using clips. I tried twice, lost to this dude who was so easy to freaking kill, and I got freaking mixed. Like, the first time, we came really close to actually getting a clip, but I got no crits, so I just got mixed. The second time, I just got I got clapped up. I can't even freaking lie. So the solo Asta video is going to have to wait. I know a lot of you guys are sad about that. We ended up doing one on a short just because I was trolling around. But once again, I want to do one with no uncuts, no nothing, just straight up, boom, the video. Now, when it comes down to this defense team here, the way you want to have it set up is usually using um, the skill two first, of course, in which he will always boost your Julius. And then at this point, Instead of using your ult first, you're usually using the skill two. Now, the reason why we're using the skill two is because not all the time people has at least a whole, what is it called? A status element and thing like that to actually help yourself here. Most of the time, people don't got that. So it usually helps you with at least, I wanna say, pushing everyone back or getting some equal damage on everyone here. So afterwards, you usually end up using this little skill too, or uh, for at least Noel, and it's usually gonna go on to Julius, but I put it on uh, Asta for now. And then at this point, it just comes down to his skill two, being here, just chilling. And then after that, you can pretty much do whatever you want. It just kind of cycles through. I think I have it set to use the skill two and then use the combine ult i will actually check that afterwards and then we'll try it on auto for the most part but um it's usually something like that so what we're gonna go ahead and do is actually use the skill two sorry the combine ult on him real quick get that actual um stun in and then from here we can just focus whoever now i will tell you this one thing sometimes the bot will focus asta so truly know that if you're going to use this team um and Julius has a hankering of just smacking up Asta quite a lot, so surely do know that. Now, it doesn't ever backfire, backfire, um, from my knowledge, though, depending on your opponent, especially if they are stupid, stupid broken, um, they can really easily kind of mess you up, and it's not a, it's not a fun time. So, let's quickly do this. I want his attention on me, um, though I feel like I might regret that, especially since I just gave him stinking, uh, what's it called? just gave him anti-magic so let's just try to follow up on dealing some more damage to him because he is about to clap me up here so let's use skill two get our defense up here and just keep whittling him down because no matter what he ends up doing he's going to deal a lot of damage to us in which that actually murked our stinking uh our julius so not very good with that but i think we still win this either way because we do have everything that we do need now I'm gonna shields up because pretty sure. Okay, I was about to say I'm pretty sure this isn't gonna kill, but just in case, we don't freaking try. So the team is pretty easy. It's pretty nice. It really does come in handy. I'm actually gonna go ahead and give it a shot on auto so you guys can actually see it in action how it will end up actually performing for defensive. So 
depending on who you're fighting, it could be different. But for the most part, from what I've been at least dealing with, for the most part, I catch an L every once in a while. Every other time is usually a defense victory. Now, is this defense breakable? Pretty easily breakable. I'm, I'm, I'm not even going to lie to you. It's pretty easy to be broken. Um, one of the few things about it. So, like, I got three victories here. I think we took a couple L's. Yeah, we took two L's and then we got another attack victory and then we got another L there. So, like... It is pretty breakable. It definitely requires one of those teams that you do need to have your characters together. Now, the way I have it set up, just to be specific, is like this. So skill two, ultimate, um, skill two, ultimate, skill two, ultimate, and skill two, ultimate. So everything is going to be the one, two, and it's going to really help you out when you're actually trying it out. So let me go ahead and set this up so you guys can actually see it in action. And we're going to actually go ahead and give it a shot. For the most part, it's actually not that bad. It's pretty dang good. I am kind of disappointed that I don't got better gear to actually make them do it a little bit better. Uh, but yeah, it is kind of it's kind of interesting to see how we can do it. But see what we got. Versus a radius. I do not like fighting radius teams. Radius teams are quite annoying to deal with. But um, go ahead and use the skill too. This is the reason why, because then we can kind of try to pick off someone really early. And at this point, well, they got their shield up. Okay, let's shield up ourselves here. And, um, oh, no, she ends up actually, yeah, she shields up on uh, Julius, which is kind of expected. But at this point, now you have counter attacks, you have your shields, you have the defense up, you literally have everything to, like, do good. So as you can tell, this is what ends up happening. It's just his counter attack fest. He's already boosted. Everything's going good. Um, we have our damage resistance from William, and it's just pretty much picking off the team. Now, where things can go south is when you're fighting Black Asta himself. As we all know, Black Asta does not care. Okay, if he is alone, Homie can still deal some decent damage. But overall, it's pretty easy just to get these claps. So, this is something that I feel like a lot of you guys are going to enjoy. A lot of you guys really want to uh, go ahead and give a shout out. I don't know if I really want to. Yeah, I don't got gems just to try and get that up here. But um, it's one of those teams that can really be really good. Now, where I've seen that it actually loses quite a lot to is to one of these teams. If you have a really like min max got dang Noel, it makes things a lot harder because of course she's restricting your SP. She's um, what is it called? Hurting you when it comes down to what you're able to use with magic attack and stuff like that. It's becoming a whole just if you kill her, then you're in good luck. If you don't kill her, well, uh, boohoo, too bad, you're dead. But um, lucky for us, we got some smacks in. Um, one of their characters is already gone here. And we've already pretty much set up. So at this point, it's all right. Just, we just got to have to live now. Because remember, we are losing SP. But luckily, William didn't lose any SP. Everyone's still kind of low. And so all we have to do now is just kind of just work with the punches. Though this is what gets me scared. That man right there. Now, as I did say, Asa does not care. Asa is one of the few units that will still look at you and be like, you're a whole freaking freebie. So truly do know this. This is what ends up happening. But luckily for us, we had our things ready. Now, um, that is one of the instances where you can end up losing on defense. We ended up getting a little lucky and actually just winning on a defense here or at least winning on our attack with that, but it can go very south. So let's really keep that in note. Now we're gonna do, I think, two more runs just to go ahead and show you guys exactly what ends up happening. Uh, and then we're just gonna do what happens here for the most part. Now, I don't think I've faced anyone using Mimosa. So this is gonna be a first. <laughs> I am kind of interested to see how this works because I know um, Mimosa does help a decent bit when it does come down to, of course, with her revives or with uh, a lot of her healing. But I haven't really seen too many of these guys shuffling about. So I am kind of interested to see how this is going to go for them, um, at least to see what ends up happening. So Bonk gets some nice damage off. And uh, now I think we can just counterattack. So boom, he's dead already. Yeah, sure, he gets revived, but I'd rather it be on him rather than being on a uh, Julius here because Julius will be a little bit more of a challenge to get rid of and uh wow this guy is pretty easy to get out of here so 
got our upgrades. Everything's going smooth. And it's, it's literally just going to be this whole thing over and over. So Asta is going to be pretty much the secret weapon that is going to be needed at the end of the game. While with Black Asta or like Julius, he's going to be your main DPSer. So you will be having Asta in more of a supportive role, at least until he gets low. And then the man's probably going to cook. So just uh, let that man cook. So at this point, boom, easy kill. And then it's just it's just quite easy at this point where there's no way we're losing this. Now, she could very well sort of at least revive, but I don't think that's going to help her out anyways. So boom, get another win pretty quick and easy. All right, so we're going to go into our last one. Do you guys think we're going to win? Do you guys think we're going to lose? Comment down below. And uh, oh, of course, we're facing a dude in delinquents right now. I don't like that because delinquents has actually a decent bit of like tryhards over there. So I am scared. Let's see what we got here. Using our skill too easy. Oh, they're going back for the knockback strategy off rip. So, I mean, like that could have been very bad. Heck, could have been. Heck, this is still bad because we don't, we won't have our uh, our counters up at least if William dies. So that, of course, is going to be a little bit of a damper move. Nothing I really want to deal with. But boom, he's gone. Easy as that. Boom, he's gone. Easy as that. Uh, he's gone. All right, let's go. <laughs> All righty. So that was a clean sweep for the most part here. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, smash that like button, which for hey, to subscribing if you are new. Um, this is definitely by far my best defense team that I per se like. If you guys want to try it out, be sure, of course, to have the gears all in order and in check. Um, when it does come down to the characters, I guess I didn't show you all of my gears that I was using. So, of course, I'll go ahead and flash these gears here when it comes down to the units. Um, when you come to William, he's not even fully done yet at all these are actually all kind of just trash pieces anyways but i'm using this i have a lr defense piece on here um when it comes down to his skills we only have skill two but uh, at least buff here with his skill page and the reason why uh william is also so low no talents so i have not worked on him he only has a speed stone other than that he has not been worked on so um that is one character julius you already know is just pure dps we have too much dps on this character um, he has one defense piece, but other than that, everything is absolute DPS. We have all just LR attack pieces for the most part here. So that's what's helping him deal a lot of damage here. And then with our Noel, we built her as a defensive Noel, of course. Um, so surely do get that built if you really want to give this a try. But um, without further ado, we're going to go ahead and close it out. Your boy has got to get up this video and also make a thumbnail very, very soon. So uh, yeah, I'm going to be speedy. So see you guys soon. Peace.